Hi there, my name's Marcus, uh, otherwise known as Country Wood Smoke, and uh, today I'd like to show you how to cook uh, the biggest steaks you've ever seen in your life. So, uh, yeah, just have a look at these. These are beautiful uh, rib cut ribs, so that's the ribeye there, that's the rib cut out and uh, on the bone, beautiful. These are Dexter's and they've been aged for uh, four weeks, absolutely fantastic. Local meat and uh, I'm going to use a bit of a uh, bit of barbecue rub on it that I use to, just to spice up all my meat. Just to add a little bit of taste in there extra, a little bit of smokiness. But I won't add any salt yet, just a little bit of that dry rub in there and the recipe will be on the website. Just helps it along, massage it in lovely. I'm going to cook these beautiful steaks straight onto the coals. These are called dirty steaks. Um, they also do a very similar way of cooking them in Italy, uh, Bistecca. I've got some screaming hot coals here that I've uh, been uh, getting ready for a few minutes in the, the um, barbecue chimney just to get ready. So they're absolutely screaming hot now. So I'm going to put them onto my barbecue. So you've got some lovely red hot coals there to cook on. As you can see I've got some burning raging white hot coals here and I'm literally just going to chuck these beautiful steaks straight onto the coals like that. No grill, no messing around. This is how cavemen used to cook. Beautiful straight onto the coal like that. Press it down. Ready to go those are. Look at that smoke coming off there. You don't need to worry about a little bit of flame with these bad boys, they're big enough to take it. As you can see, the uh, coals barely stick to it. And you just turn them over, get them cooking lovely. See the, the coal just do doesn't stick to it at all. Just chars it and grills it lovely. A little bit of flame's not going to hurt. Get it going really beautiful. As you can see it's kicking out a lot of heat here now so uh, I'm going to put these steaks on, just finish them off. I started searing them and the fire started getting a bit too hot so uh, just take, take it, let things calm down a little bit. A little bit of fire doesn't hurt, it's going to do, do the job nicely but we don't want to overcook them. I want them beautiful and pink on the inside. It's all been getting a bit hot there so uh, just taking the steaks off just for a minute. Move the coals out of the way a little bit and just finish them off. And because these are uh, big old steaks, I'm just going to finish them off with the lid on just for a bit, just for a bit of smokiness. And I'm going to add a few uh, wood chunks here just to uh, give it that nice smoky taste and uh, leave, put, pop the lid on for a minute just to come up to a nice medium rare 